I shot a couple videos today already. And um, I'm going to shoot one more. <laughs> um, I felt an urgency to start posting more videos again. To start to be documenting this process. Um, as it goes along. Today is December 5th. And uh, I've started to feel an urgency to get married. <laughs> and it's really weird. And I don't know what to do. Um, so I went on a date last night. My wife has been dead. I mean, she passed away almost four months ago. And already I'm on a date. And it's weird because um, a friend of mine gave me some advice. And he told me, just after Henry died, not to rush into any big decisions. And specifically, he'd mentioned um, to not move or change jobs or get married. Well, I moved. I moved in with my sister. And it's been a huge blessing for me. And I'm, I don't see how I could have gone forth with that. But it's, it's been so nice to have to be with family. But that was a big decision that I was going to try and avoid making, and I did it. And it was hard. And I changed jobs. I moved to a new city. I mean, I, I couldn't do a three-hour commute every day. Um, but that's been a huge blessing to be working at Jones Paint Glass. And I talked a little bit about that in other videos, but it's just been, it's been really awesome. And so... That's two of the big things that I was trying to avoid. And now I feel pressured <laughs> to go for the third one. And, um, so I feel, I feel torn, but luckily the date went really well last night. I was able to go with someone who's a good friend who, while I feel they're amazingly attractive, um, they're also somebody I feel comfortable with and was able to not feel too nervous. I did feel nervous, but I felt nervous in that I didn't want to change the dynamic of our friendship. Um, but at the same time, I don't know. I don't know where that's going to go. I'm excited to see where it goes. Um, but I wanted to... I want to be sharing the big experiences that I have. Um, so I felt an urgency to post this video and all of a sudden I don't know what to talk about. I, there's a good chance that she'll watch this video and so there's things I can't say. There's things that I should say. Um, my date last night that she'll watch this video. Um, I feel excited. I feel encouraged. I feel amazingly blessed. So I want to share this video. I want to share what I'm going through. Um, I do feel like my parent, my, my children need a mom. In fact, the other day, Fiona came to me and said, Graydon needs a mommy. And I felt it strongly like it wasn't just a little girl saying hey go take care of your your, your son because he's crying but it was great and needs a mommy um and i felt very prepared i felt emotionally strengthened that maybe i can do that i don't feel like i need to be married within a few months i feel like i should be preparing myself for marriage and I feel very inadequate for that. Um, one of the things that happened last night on our date is somebody asked me what my career was. And it was an embarrassing question for me because that's not something um, that I feel is strong in my life. So we'll see. <laughs> we'll see who wants to take on this great challenge of me and my kids and, and all of this, but, 
but I'm excited. I'm excited to find out to go through this process. So I wish I knew more that I could have a little more stability and say, okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to follow this. Um, I don't, I don't know what's going to happen, but I do feel excited. I do feel strengthened. I do feel like it's right for me to start dating. Um, and that's a little scary. Uh, I mean, why, why would it feel scary to feel right? I, I don't know. It's, there's a lot of mixed emotions here. Um, I love and care for Anne-Marie deeply. And, uh, and so to move on and start having those feelings for someone else is a little weird. And it's a little awkward. But it's a little exciting too. Um... So there I am. That's the video for today. Uh, I do want to share, oh, some other things I want to talk about. I was able to go um, to, to go see uh, Christmas Around the World the other day. And it was awesome uh, because they did some great dances. And one of the things that I learned in this process of I was looking to try and build my YouTube channel um, was the importance of storytelling, of making an emotional connection with people, and of sharing. There's an introduction, there's a conflict, and there's a resolution. And that's the way that, that a good story comes across, and that's how you connect emotionally with people. And I could see that in some of the dances. Uh, especially, there was one dance where... Um, It was a collaboration between Brigham Young University and this other university from China. And so they have these dancers to come together and perform a dance and they don't speak the same language. I think there, you know, obviously there was help in, in getting all of this coordinated, but that story was kind of presented in the dance where first the Chinese dancers come on and they dance in their way and, and then the, um, the Americans come on and they dance in their way and there's like they're trying to dance together but there's conflict because we have different cultures and we have different ways of dancing and then as the dance progressed that there was a resolution in the end they're dancing together and they've mixed their two the two cultures and it was it was beautiful to watch and I've ha I've never had an experience quite like that um, there were times in the in the dance not just this dance, but other dances where it was emotional. Um, I felt connected at an emotional level to where I almost cried. I think I did cry a little bit. I, I cry much more easily now. Um, my emotions are always near the surface. But uh, to watch, to cry just from watching a dance, it was, it was moving. It was powerful. It was, it was amazing. Um, and so I talked with my sons a little bit after and, and it was a beautiful experience. And so I'm having some wonderful experiences and I want to be able to share that. And so again, I'm going to start posting, I'm going to try and post more videos. Ugh, this one, I don't know that I'll have time to do any editing on it. I'll just have to post it and with whatever sound problems I have. I've had some big sound problems in the past. I was able to solve some of them, but I'm constantly being presented with new problems as I'm trying to tell my story and, um, and reach out to new people so that they can see my story. I want, I'm hoping that this, my sharing in my story is helpful to people and is uplifting to them in their lives. And so that's why I'm doing it. And so I want to be able to share it with the most people because it's a lot of work to do this. And so I want it to be valuable, to not just be valuable to one or two people, but to be valuable to a lot of people. Um, if it's valuable to just a few people, that's fine. That's, that's good too. Um, I've had some people, some subscribers, 
request videos and it's been cool to do that experience um, to to share and so yeah feel free to talk to me um, I've had some great words of encouragement and it's been a wonderful experience and um, I don't recommend that you lose your wife that you lose your spouse but I do recommend strongly that you turn to the Lord in whatever your endeavor is because he will be there to strengthen you as he has been to strengthen me and there's so many things in my life that are going on where I don't have qu answers to questions and I feel lost but at the same time because of the strength the Lord has given me while feeling like I don't know where I'm going I feel like I am being guided so I don't know where I will end up but I trust the hand that guides me and it has made so much difference because of the peace which that brings because of the power that is there to be able to say no I don't know but it's okay that I don't know and I can have comfort and have the peace and the strength that comes from the atonement so there's my video for today a little bit different than some of the other ones I've posted but I felt I feel good about this one um, now I just drove to work I'm going to go ahead and go inside and actually do some work hopefully the, um, this video turns out feel free to subscribe feel free to share these videos with your friends um, and thank you for watching <laughs>